uh, identity and access management is continuously growing. That's what I'm experiencing in, in my company. And uh, it's also a changing market, new compliance stuff and things like that. So it's, it's uh, very, uh, it's an enterprise to, 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 to be part of that. And it's, it's a lot of fun. Um, as in other fields, I do believe that open source will get more and more important. I mean, in the uh, age of uh, cloud computing, uh, uh, open source, uh, even big uh, players now know that open source is a good thing. If, it's, uh, if you have professional support, and there are a lot of good IAM open source products out there that uh, provide such uh, support. Um, but most of the companies providing such are rather small than big. I mean, we have Red Hat the, as, as the, maybe the only big, big one in the market, and a lot of uh, uh, small, small companies. And, but there, are, there, there will be more and more very big projects uh, with, I don't know, 250 consulting days and things like that. And that's why I think uh, open source companies should even cooperate more than they already do. And uh, yeah, and it's all about business models. Uh, so there are different roles in such projects. We have the developers, we have the integrators, project managers, uh, we have uh, uh, operators of software as a service. Uh, we have marketing people, sales people, and uh, uh, community building uh, people. That's the very important thing in open source, of course. All these roles can have different business models. And uh, so basically, uh, you might have heard of the initiative from Evolveum uh, called Identity and Access Management Ecosystem, or Open Source Ecosystem. And it's a bit, uh, I, I want to, so th this has stalled somehow, and there might be reasons for that or not, but uh, I, I just want to uh, uh, revive uh, such, uh, such uh, uh, thinkings. Um, yeah, uh, um, so let's, let's work on such an uh, ecosystem. And, um, and again, uh, uh, let's uh, also see the, customer requirement that a customer wants to have a contract with one, uh, one party uh, 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 and, and not with uh, five, five different ones. So again, it's a, uh, it's a matter of aligning business models and of creating trust uh, between us. Um, uh, customers often want to buy in uh, uh, all these roles and uh, some companies only provide uh, some of these roles. So, um, so, and, and the, I mean, the, this is happening already, this model. One company is developing the software, another pro uh, company is the main point of contact for the project, and there might be a third company that provides software as a service for, for, for that. Uh, and th this is working perfectly. Uh, uh, you all know such uh, partnerships. Um, but uh, may, may, maybe we could even uh, uh, create more such uh, models than this that is already uh, uh, working uh, quite nice. And of course, uh, in, in providing support, it's also quite usual that the project partner does second level support and the, uh, the, the vendor, the, the, uh, the developing partner, does the third level support. So this all is happening right now. Uh, uh, but I, I think it has to happen more, uh, more and more in the future. So we need a lot of trust between the companies. And I have trust to a number of, of uh, such companies. And we meet at LDAP Cons or at the Time Conference in Vienna. And that, that, that's a very good thing. But I see that the business models of, of these different uh, companies sometimes are not so well aligned. And I, I think it's about interoperable business models that we have to think more about. Um, yes, and I think open source is something different than closed source. So our business models should look a, at least a bit different than, than the business models of, of those others. Yeah? And uh, uh, the basic thing is uh, the so-called subscription fees should really be a value, uh, third level support, uh, some promises, 
and not just a license uh, as you buy Microsoft uh, client licenses or things like that. Um, yeah, and the cost model. So uh, I'm dreaming of a world that uh, such an ecosystem has a common model for pricing, which is not based on per entity uh, and per number of uh, connectors, which might be based on the uh, full-time equivalence of the customer. The bigger the customer, the more money he has, the more money he can pay for, for uh, such solutions. But there, there are total, it's quite open. These are just a few possibilities. I'm just, they all exist in the world. And if we want to have a good ecosystem, we should think about aligning such models. Yeah, so uh, I, I'd like to discuss, but maybe not here, but maybe we should form a sort of a mailing list and discuss it there and maybe even create a business association, open, international open source IIM business association or things like that. And there are, there are some trends, some people are thinking about that already. Uh, so uh, maybe we should start discussing interoperable customer contract options, interoperable business models, trust establishing intercompany contracts, and uh, cost models. And that was it. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, time for questions? Yes, we have time for questions. Okay. Thank you, Peter, for bringing this uh, this topic up again. Uh, was it in 2015 we discussed this? Was it Denver? We seems like. Uh, what well, was it? So it, it, it might have been discussed at the last uh, time conference in Vienna, where I wanted to give the presentation, but I didn't. We have a, there is a mailing list on Google where on, on this very topic, I thought that it's, it's been quite inactive. Exactly. I, is it the uh, WSO thing you're talking about? I just saw an um, email. I'll look it up and okay. talk to you. About it, but I thought we had a mailing list on it. But I think it's a great idea. Yeah, I just thought maybe think about it and contact me. More questions? And I'm sorry that it's a bit off topic and it's not technical at all, but we have to think about such things as well, I think. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs>